I'm Ali and I work in bed management. And my name is Michael and I'm a volunteer. Today, through this video, we're going to show you how the volunteer service is going to help patients play a more active part in their journey towards getting better and getting home. With our help, we can make sure that the patients really understand what is wrong with them and what they can expect during their stay in hospital. The Trust has introduced to all the wards an initiative called SAFER. The basic principles of SAFER works towards all patients having a daily senior review, an estimated date of discharge and a good understanding of what is wrong with them. All patients should know the answers to the following four questions. What is the matter with me? What can I expect to happen today? What needs to happen for me to be able to go home? When can I expect to go home? As a volunteer, we are in the ideal place to assist in checking that this process works for every patient. Staff have been busy designing prompts that they hope will help to give the patients their own voice and a greater understanding of how they can help their journey progress. This is a place map with the uh, designed four relevant questions. It is wiped clean and will be placed on the bedside cabinet. Here is a discharge leaflet which has the four questions as well as other useful information patients need to know when we are planning their discharge. We can provide the link by making sure that the patients have the prompts and they are asking the questions of the doctors and nurses who are looking after them. We've designed posters to go above beds. What we would like you to do is when you're on the wards, choose a bay each day and ask the patients the four questions. If they know the answer, we are asking you to put a tick in that box. And if they don't, then please put a cross in it. We hope the poster above the bed will also prompt staff to ensure they are keeping patients better informed. We will also fill in a simple form for the ward sister, which checks whether the patient has a placemat, a discharge leaflet, and whether they have any other questions as a result of our chat. After we finish in each bay, we would then hand the form to the nurse in charge. We hope that with your help, patients will feel empowered to ask the questions that gives them better understanding and improves communication in a big way. We have excellent support from the sisters on the wards for you to do this, but should you have any issues, then please let us know immediately by contacting the volunteer coordinator. So we hope that you feel up to the challenge and find this as exciting as we do.